Hey guys, Garrett here. A while back, I showed you a mobile home that we had evicted the tenant and we had just gotten it back. And it was absolutely filthy and it was roach infested. If you wanna check that one out, it is right here. There's also a link down in the description. But since that time, we were able to get that home turned around, get all the roaches out of it, and get a new tenant in it. But it did take us a while to do. So anyway, today I wanna to show you the before and the after of how that home turned out. Here's before in the living room and kitchen area of this home, and as you can see, there's just tons and tons of stuff. We did let the tenant come back in and take whatever they wanted, but uh, you know, there's still a ton that was left over. This spot right here is where the dogs were pinned up, and man, it was just soaked in pee. So there's no saving this floor. Tons of roaches. It was it was incredible. The kitchen really wasn't all that terribly bad. Didn't really need any repair per se, just a lot of cleaning. And here is this home afterwards. Heck of a lot cleaner. Of course, we had to replace all of this floor, put LVP down. All of the walls were painted everywhere except for what was uh, wallpaper there. But the kitchen was still in good shape. So again, just a really deep cleaning. Same with that floor. It was good. It was replaced the last time that we did this. So it's fine. This is the kid's bedroom and it was just, again, absolutely filthy. The rugs, I wasn't sure we were gonna be able to save those, but yeah, a kid was actually living like this. And just stuff, food, clothes, junk everywhere, including in the bathroom. And of course, underneath all of that stuff are tons and tons of roaches. Ugh. They were just crawling everywhere. It was thick. Believe it or not, this is not the thickest one we've ever had, but it was bad. This is the front bedroom. Believe it or not, this is the same carpet. It was professionally clean, looks really good. New paint on these walls, of course, totally cleaned out, no more roaches. Bathroom, same deal, it was very dirty, kinda nasty, but repainted and it looks great now. Here was the master bedroom before. Again, just lots and lots of stuff. This one wasn't nearly as dirty, although it was very cluttered, but once we got all the stuff out, it was pretty easy to do. This was the master bedroom. Again, professionally cleaned carpets, freshly painted walls and it is looking a heck of a lot better than what it used to of course got rid of all the stuff no more roaches here's the bathroom before wasn't very bad and there wasn't that much stuff in there but again it was pretty darn filthy the bathroom was already in nice shape so really just had to be cleaned toilet was good tub was good sink was good so this room did not require much i think this home turned out really well you know, it took a long time to do actually, not because there was a ton of work to do necessarily, but because of all the stuff that there was, as well as all of those roaches. Roaches take a long time to get rid of. I have a video of how to get rid of roaches. And if you run into a roach problem, check that out. But remember, it's a process. It does not happen overnight. It may take more than a month. This particular home, we actually left for a couple of months, just unoccupied with the baits in place to make sure that we got everything. And believe me, we got them all. It just takes time. Thankfully, this home was in a park that we own. So having that home vacant, yes, there was you know opportunity costs that it costs us by not being able to uh, occupy that home. But I would rather give someone a perfectly clean house without bugs than make a few extra bucks. All of that stuff that was in the home, like I said, we let the tenant come back and take whatever they wanted, but there were still tons and tons left. And so within the park, we actually had a few just regular trash cans and we just fill them every single week. Just keep filling, filling, filling. And what we couldn't fit inside of a trash can, we loaded up in my truck plus my tandem axle. A trailer and took to the dump. So thankfully we got rid of the stuff in a reasonable amount of time, but uh, you'd be amazed at what you can fit inside of a regular garbage can, especially if you have multiple cans that you can fill each week. So once all the stuff was gone and the roaches were cut through, 
it was still really yucky in there and it was really because of all the the pet pee that was all over that wood floor and the wall uh yeah Whew. that was it's just it was so thick and it was so gross it was nice to get rid of that but now this home is very nice it is very clean and it is very bug free thank you guys for watching make sure to hit that like button down below as well as subscribe i'll see you next time